If you want a fast and easy way to get your favorite Rocket League items, head over to RL Exchange and use code CoralCoke. They have all of the most popular items and a ton of different payment methods you can choose from. No matter what console you're on, they deliver insanely fast so you can slide into your next match in style. Just click the link in the description and go check it out for yourself. Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Today we're doing another Rocket League crate opening video. This time we've got 50 Golden Gift 22s to open, but before we get into it, I do want to remind you guys that every thousand subs on this channel, we give away a Titanium White Octane to one of you, and all you have to do to enter is subscribe to the channel and comment something down below. We are also giving away an Alpha Cap at 100,000 subscribers, so you want to make sure you are subscribed and comment something. But, we've got Gaidens as the first crate, however, we do have double the chance of painted mainframe in this crate because two of the series in this crate have mainframe in them cobalt comment okay all right but if you guys watched yesterday's video then you saw how crazy our crate luck was with the golden moon 23 crates titanium white retro sun we got four exotics i believe two of them were painted two unpainted and we got a black market it was an unpainted tune unfortunately uh, Saffron Yamains are not bad, though. Uh, but yeah, our luck has been pretty good. We've done, uh, let's see, the eggs, we got a black market. Uh, the toolkits, we got a white exotic. And then, yeah, the craziness that happened yesterday. So hopefully today we get white mainframe, white Francos, white Zombas, white Reaper wheels, because all those things are possible. White Shattered, I'm pretty sure Shattered is in this crate as well. There's a lot of opportunities here for some bangers. And uh, it's been a while, okay? It's been a while since I've had like a crazy, crazy good item from a crate. Like sure, a black market is fun and a painted exotic is fun, but I'm talking like actual bangers here. Titanium white octane Kana, that's pretty good though. Uh, like credit value bangers, things that will make me a profit. I've never gotten a titanium white mainframe from a crate, obviously. Never gotten it from a trade up either. So this would be the first time if it happened. Uh, I have gotten white zombas from a crate and a trade up. Uh, I've gotten white dracos from a trade up. I don't think I've gotten white dracos from a crate before though. Not that I remember. I've gotten white reapers a couple times, including when I was crate battling Trihouse. <laughs> that was fun. Pink dragon lord, okay. Um, but yeah. I just want to continue this luck that I've been having with the other crates. Let's go! Orange Reaper. Okay, our first painted Reaper. That's not bad. The orange and the black. It's kind of like Halloween colors. I like it. All right. All painted Reapers look good. Just the way that they designed those wheels was perfect. Pink Ouchie. It matches the uh, band-aids on there. The bandages. <laughs> nice. But I really want to see that black market or exotic glow. I've gotten so used to it with the other crates. Come on. We need to see it with this crate because this crate is the one that matters. That's why I saved it for last. The best for last. Sentinel, okay. Regardless, we're gonna have a huge trade up video because we got a lot of uh, items from all of these crates that I've been opening. So that's gonna be a banger video because possibility for painted exotics and painted black markets. Octane Kana, okay. I guess possibility for painted reapers too. If we get a white striker reaper, potentially. Uh, I don't know if there's any good imports in these. Not really, unless you get like a white striker import. But even then it's like, eh. It's not like you can get an octane from these drops. That would be crazy. Uh, or like a Fennec or something, Dominus. Dominus would be even crazy. Your Dominus is worth like 20 times what the Octane is. <laughs> Painted Octanes. Uh, but that's because you can't get those from trade-ups anymore. And Octanes, uh, once they hit the item shop, it's never going to be the same now. It, that value has tanked. Like it's been sitting around 4,000, 5,000 credits on PC for a while now. I don't think it's ever getting back to 10,000, guys. Cobalt Dragon Lord. Okay. We are halfway through after this crate. And so far, I think this has been the worst out of all the crates. Surprisingly. Makes sense, right? You have really good luck on the bad crates with bad items. And you have really bad luck on the crate with all good items. I feel like it's like that with most games. Like, every time I watch someone do like a CSGO open... 
Wait, 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 wait. Okay, all right. <clears throat> As I was saying, anytime I watch someone do like a CSGO opening, whenever they're doing like the really expensive, high value crates that have insane bangers in them, they never get it. They never get the bangers. It's always like, oh, they got the worst value thing. And then whenever they're opening like, oh, this crate was 50 cents, like really cheap crate, they get like the craziest banger, glove, knife, whatever, ends up being like worth 100 bucks. <laughs> and you might think, oh, 100 bucks, that's a lot. We're talking like in the thousands for the really good stuff though, in like the high value crates. So 100 bucks is like, like they probably spent that on the opening that they did. So at best, you're just making your money back at that point. Lime Twinser, it's crazy that there's some people that get so lucky with those CSGO openings that they actually like make a profit of like thousands. You have to get really lucky though. Really lucky. It's hard. I think it's a little bit easier in Rocket League crates in my opinion. Because like what? The hardest thing to get is a live market. 1% chance. That's not even that crazy. The hardest thing to get in the CSGO crates are like 0.001% chance. <laughs> Dominus funny book. Okay. Okay, so we've gotten one exotic. It was bad exotic. And then no black markets. Uh, <laughs> why? Why Golden Kiss? Why you gotta do this to me, man? Just give me something good. One black market. So I have one shot at a vein frame. That's it. Reaper unpainted, okay. I'd be really sad if I got a mainframe and it was unpainted. Just knowing how close I was to getting a white mainframe. Like, all it had to do is throw a paint on there and make it white. I know that's gonna happen now. Of course, I've spoken into existence. Now it's gonna happen. I think that's the second black sticker bomb we've gotten. We got a certified one earlier, if I remember correctly. Pink Lone Wolf, okay. Nine more, come on, don't do this to me. Why? Why? I don't understand why my luck sucks with these specific crates every time. Come on. Another Titanium White Octane Kana. Wow. It's giving me amazing Titanium White items, uh, but they're very rare. Imagine we got two Titanium White Reapers instead of two Titanium White Kanas, because that's the same odds. That would have been nuts. I mean, the good thing is we're getting a lot of imports, so that trade-up video gonna have a lot of chances at white Draco, white Zombas. That is the one time I got white Zombas from a trade-up was trading up uh, Golden Gift 22 imports. So I could do it again, potentially. Lucky stars, three more, come on. Please! Man, I'm so done with these crates. Ugh. If it doesn't give me a black market. Okay, I'm not even gonna say it. I was gonna say I'll never open this crate again. <laughs> but nah, I will for sure. I'm gonna keep trying. I need that white mainframe, man. Come on. Last crate of the video, titanium white striker mainframe. I'm actually sad. I'm actually sad. This was the worst opening. The worst opening with the best crate. I, you can't make this stuff up, man. But as you can see, we're gonna have a pretty good uh, trade-up video. So stay tuned for that tomorrow. But uh, yeah, much love and uh, we'll see you then. Peace.